Hi everyone, it's Gail, and I am working on journal number four, the Victorian journal. And I have to apologize, last time we worked on it, my phone shut off again. I think I'm going to have to quit putting it off and go in and think about a new phone. But anyway, we will get started. Let's say hi and hugs to Lucy, Janet, Carol and Beverly. Thank you so much for watching and your kind comments. Okay, where we were was we were putting things into here and I was just counting the back side here to see how many I had in here. I'm going to count this as one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. So we really do probably have enough decorated pages, but I kind of really want to use this in here. And so let's see if we can find a, find a good spot for it. Okay, but not great. This is cute there, though. Hmm. Well, let's go on the other side and see what we think. Oh, we've got a lot going on there. I mean, if we put that there, that is kind of a lot going on, but I kind of like it. I don't know. Let's see if we can find some place better. Ooh, could just go right here. Yeah, I like that. Okay, I'm going to go with that. And I am going to save these three for another journal. I'm going to stick this back in our ephemera basket in case we need something little. But this is going to go back in here. Okay. So let's get attaching things and fabric flip being the first. So hope you're all doing well today. I, <laughs> my phone turned off and then uh, emergency alert came through. They were, it was like they were testing the emergency alert system. And I don't know if that's what shut off my phone or what, but I wanted to do two videos because I wanted to continue working on this, but I shorted you about 15 minutes on the last one. Shorted myself too. <laughs> so let's get our fabric, or no, this is art glitter glue. I'm going to go down a little bit because this might hang over slightly in. This way I won't be getting, be getting glue everywhere. It's pretty close, but... Okay. Alrighty. We will just continue on, and um, I will be putting a few paper clips on too. There were things for the pages that needed paper clips. This is going to go here, but I think I want to do a little bit of um, stenciling. See which one should we use? Just what happened to my oh there they are. I might do a little bit of the Tim Holtz stencils. Which one has the most stuff on it? I like that one. Let's use that one. Okay. Set those over there. 
Okay, so let's just kind of go down the side first. Cross part of the top. These uh, stationary pages have caused a little extra work in terms of stenciling, but I do, it's kind of fun to just have a, a blank page that you can work on too. So it hasn't been so bad. These are, this stencil's fun to do with um, brown and green and red, but I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna go with the brown today, because I do want the pocket to be the highlight. Okay. So now we can put this in the middle and we've got a little bit of something on the page besides white. I apologize if I'm not super peppy today. I, well, you know, we were in Bozeman yesterday and um, I just didn't sleep very well which happens sometimes first night, not at home. And um, yeah, so I'm a little snoozy. And as you know, I'm not much of a napper, so. So I'm just, I'm just bucking up, Buttercup. See, we've got these babies sleeping there and you can't even see them, but. And I'm cutting off a joyful Christmas a little bit, but I think it's okay. So this particular one gets glued down. This is one of the Roxy Weekly Challenges. Anxious to see what she's got up her sleeve for next week. Just kind of Okay, and then this flips out and it's a pocket at the top, so we'll have to find something to put in there, no doubt. Okay, we were gonna put this here. I think I'm gonna put it on as a tuck because then you can put even more on this page. And just Put it in the corner, kind of, and we can stick something behind it. Something for writing or some, whatever. So, okay, and then this is going to go here. I'll make that a pocket behind, too. I don't know if I'll put anything in there, but just in case. Okay. I really like the colors of that with the, the colors over here. Oop, we've got more stenciling to do. Let's see if I put that, I think I'm gonna go midway with that so I can stick something over here. Okay. Well, back out come the pine cones. Oh my gosh, we had such wind today that it the pine needles were just raining off the trees. So my husband's like, oh my gosh, do I mulch those into the grass? Do I just suck them up with the mower? He's trying to figure out what he wanted to do. 
and I'm just like, I don't know, but <laughs> every the grass is just covered. Oh, it's one of the things my husband doesn't like about the pine trees. They are messy, but I love them. I love feeling like I'm out in the woods when I'm right in my own home. But then I don't have to clean up after them and keep suggesting that I might get somebody to do our yard work, but so far he hasn't decided that that's something he wants to do. He'd rather complain. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. He did, though, you guys, this was big. He did finally say he thought he might get someone to do the shoveling this winter. I was like, whoa. Miracle of miracles. I mean, he has been telling me I will do it when I'm ready. I just thought he was ready earlier than he thought he was ready. <laughs> so, yeah. Well, it was a... He goes, remind me to tr try and look for somebody to do the snow. I said, okay. So I better remember when I go up to remind him again. <laughs> okay, he's... Yeah, he's into... The guys are supposed to come blow out the sprinklers. They haven't come yet. I said that, well, it would be on Tuesday for you. You should see me hopping around on filming videos because I have to wait until Friday at least Friday, to um, film Wednesday's videos because I like to do the Roxy's Challenge on those. And so, um, yeah, so I have to kind of, kind of have to wait. Okay, so this has a cute Santa on the back. I'm going to, nope, I'm going to use a, Rusty paper clip. Oh, and we need to we need to stencil. This one I need to do the whole page. Just because the decoration comes off. This is an easy stencil to use. It doesn't doesn't have bits that bend up, you know. I appreciate that. So go about that there. Um yeah, that makes it easier when you can just scrubby rubby and not be worried about bending your stencil. I didn't tell you Tuesday about our trip to Bozeman. So Addie's senior night's coming up and they recognize the seniors at that. It's their last home game of volleyball. And um, one of the things they do is they blow up photos of the girls when they were babies. <laughs> Oh my gosh, the one of Addie is so cute. She's wearing a cowboy hat and her little her little baby face under the cowboy hat. It's so cute. So that'll be fun. I think my son's gonna try and make it. And I think one of my daughters from Denver might too, which would be fun. Okay, so yay. Well that looks cute. So now we're gonna attach this on there. And then it can be taken off and journaled under all of that. Let me 
go under there. Maybe what I'll do is flip you around. With the small side by the pocket. That makes more sense. Okay, then this one needs to go around that, which is always a little bit tricky. I find it tricky. Um, maybe I'm going to try a new technique. Usually I go around the whole thing and then try and fit it on there. But what if... I did this and just put that on first. I think that's the secret. Okay. Like a so. And it's semi straight. Wouldn't want it to be perfect. That'd be dull, wouldn't it? Okay, this is going to go on as a tuck. Right here. And let's see what else we've got. Oh, we've got this guy. And I decided I needed to trim a little bit off of there. So let's do that. Let me get my weight. Okay. I'm just going to take a ever such a slight bit off of there. Let's see if that fits better. Okie dokie. Yes, that fits better. Okay. I betcha we end up using some collage page to make some big journal cards for these. Because I don't really have any big journal cards over there. Okay, so... There it is. Okay. Where is that? Okay. This I'm going to put on as a belly band. So a big tag can go in the back. Yeah, I don't have near enough stuff made up yet for... This journal there's gonna be some there's gonna be some making that needs to happen I think okay and then the belly band kind of there I'm I'm kind of oh Sorry, I had to move, have to move it up a little bit. Um, I'm kind of centered in the green space here since we've got, got lace in the way, in a good way. All right, that has everything in it. Okay, let's put our stencils away. Don't need those now for the moment. I think I'm just going to set those over here with these other stencils. And they're handy. Okay. Let's see. We... We have stuff. I want to see what's in here. You guys, I forgot to look at the time again. I'm so discombobulated with my phone turning off and stuff. Um, I'm going to say we've been at it about 20 minutes-ish. Okay. Let's see, it's almost 1. I'm going to say about one twenty or so. We should probably be done. I don't know. 
We might just go till I feel like being done. <laughs> oh, I'm so aggravated at my phone. It's annoying. Okay. So, there's little pockets. These are cute. Cute. Okay. Little tag there. There's a big... Big file folder. There's a big something there. Here is a big pocket. And then there's side pockety things. Hmm. I don't know. Let's just play around a little bit. I What I do know is I need more stuff. So, this is, this is kind of different. I need, I need the inside, though, to be prettier. So, what am I going to grab? Over here, I have Roxy Creations, some things that maybe could work. I'm just gonna cut this off. Sorry, I was listening to my husband, he was on the phone. <laughs> So, I'm just going to put that up like that. This edge, I think I want to be up to this edge. because I would like that little flower to be in there. Not sure how this is going to work, but we're going to try it. Okay, so I'm going to put glue on this and glue it down. this corner okay let's see how we do just basically backing it like a journal card kind of but more for the pattern than anything okay Okay, okay, okay. Let's get that right here. Okay, squish it. it out and a little fun piece there um, put it back here okay don't have much here little bit there I could okay sorry I'm quiet like I said I'm I'm napping excuse me <laughs> have myself a little snooze oh goodness I don't know what my deal was last night that I couldn't sleep usually I sleep really good 
at my daughter's house, but I went to sleep fine. I just kept waking up. Had an icky dream. I woke up from that. And yeah. So anyway, I'm about snoozy now. Okay. Thank you for your patience while I did that. There's always the fast forward ahead button if, if I'm boring. Okay. Let me just do that. Okay. That's kind of cute. I'm getting more go that way. And there's space to write in there. That's nice. And what I was thinking of doing is to see if I could fit one of these pockets on here. Maybe even like one like this. Okay, those are the two that go that way. See, I feel like that one goes better this way. This one goes, you know, the other way. So, this one would be better like that. So, I think I could do this one like that, though. Okay. Now, I want to make it stronger. So, how about a little book page? To do that. Yeah, this was just on not even my Red River 26 pound matte photo paper. This is on copy paper. Let's see, I could go this way. Doesn't matter what way the Print goes, we're just using it to thicken it up a little. And then we're going to need to decorate it. Yeah, I think this journal will take me a bit longer than the others. Just because I don't have as many things to decorate with. So, got to make them on the, as we're doing the journal. Which is why, as you know, I love to have ephemera made ahead. But just didn't this time. Okay. I think we'll do a little of this. Before we put that on there. My husband's kind of been a walking maniac on the treadmill today. I don't know. I know he didn't want to walk outside today because the, supposedly the guys are coming to fix or to do our sprinklers. Ooh, okay, that's cute. Gonna need to um, distress the edges of the file folder too, I think. And then we'll see what we have that could be a little, oopsie, be a little decoration on this. Okay, let's give this a little distress. I'm so distressed. <laughs> My humor is tired too, isn't it? <laughs> Pretty tired humor today. Ooh, that looks cute though. Um, distressed. Yep, we needed that for sure.
I mean, a person could put something on the back too, really could, but it's good writing space as is. So maybe I'll leave that. And then there's, you know, there's three bits of writing space. I need to do this inside, I might. I'm hoping that this might go behind the glassine bag or something. Okay, there we go there. All right, I want to grab my bone folder and see if I can smoosh that down a bit. All right, what do we have to mm, not really anything in the uh, there's nothing really in there. Maybe. Oh, perfect. All right. Just glue her on there and that little pocket will be good. Now I'm thinking about the sort of library card that came with the digital kit. I might put it inside of here. Oh, that's cute. It almost looks like it's shaped in order to accommodate that little tree. Okay, so there is that. Then I'm thinking I could back this and put it in there and then put this in somewhere in the journal. Okay, so what do we want to do with you? I just put it on some cardstock. Oh, yep, I do. Okay, no problem. Let's put this over the top to dress dry and get that smooshed down a little bit. Okay. Sorry, I had that right up to my face for some reason. Oh, that's nice. Good uh, thickness and everything. Okay. And let's do this. Okay. 
Hey, that's a good space to write on too. This whole thing is given some good writing space. Okay, so there's that. So this is gonna go in here and something can go in there. Maybe, I don't know what yet. Um, I wonder if this little tag, this is from Saved by Grace Creation. Isn't that cute? So cute. That maybe could go there. I like that better in that spot we'll have another place for this little girl I'm sure okay so grabbing the book back where like we've got the this big thing too but it's not big enough I don't think yeah no where is then there's that but it's on the wrong side kind of However, one could go like so. There. I actually really like that. The red, the pinks. Yep, I do. I like it. Need something in there. I mean, we just need a lot of stuff. Oh, they're spraying out the... I can hear it. Can you guys hear it? go in there, wouldn't it? Isn't that cute? I love that one. That's one of those little tracing paper strips. So, put that there. Okay. Got the fabric flip. I've already got something in there, and I'm loving that. Okay, so then we're up to this, which I was looking at this. I'm not sure it will fit. It does, it fits. Um, was that the one that needed uh, something? I kind of think it might be. Oh, yeah, we already put her. Okay. And this is supposed to be tucked under there. And I had this little birdie kind of holding it too. Okay, cool. Let's just pop that in there then. I look at all these things and I'm like, oh man, there's a lot of work that goes into these. So that is just kind of a little tuck space. There. Yep. Okay, I'm going to put her in there. Okay, we need something big for this, but like I can't use this because it'd be too tall. And this is too wide. So we need something for there. We do, we do. This can have something slip behind. Like I could put that in there. That would be cute. But I need a, a journal card for in here. Okay. Um, or something. Hmm. I think a journal card would be better than that. Got a couple of tags that might work. 
That's pretty, isn't it? Okay, let's see. That or this. Ooh, I think I like that. Okay, and then there's writing space there. Okay. This, then, is going to go in here. Okay, there's that. Need something for in there. Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> okay, that's already got a tag in it. But need something in the back, and I don't have anything yet. So that's a spot where we need to do, to use the um, collage page. Okay, and then this also needs something kind of square. As does that. So two things square. This. Put her in there. I could. Um... What else do I have? I have this tag. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. I need something for in there. Here, we could put you in there. We could put you in there. Or do you want you in here. I think I want you in there. We have this. Oh, it's just a little too big. But it could go behind. So that needs that needs more stuff. I mean I could I could put that there, but Hmm, I don't mind that, but need something behind it. So, there's more to be made for this little journal. Need something for there. I think this is too tall, probably. Yep. Now this, could I, would that fit? It does. That fits great. <laughs> Legs are sticking out, but that's okay. I was also thinking about this, but I like how that kind of fills it up. And then this slips down for a writing space. Okay. So this big old tall tag, I don't have a spot for it yet. I need something for in there too. Okay, let's real quick like look in our in our bucket there could be some things that we could possibly press into service oh you know what i have these that i made in the roxy's weekly challenge i wonder if one of those would go through um here i think i like i'd like the red more Nope, I don't like it. It's too bulky. And this too, it would be too bulky for that too, I think. Yeah, no. No, no, no. Yeah, no, those... Not so much. Don't need any more sacks. Oh, you know. Oops. Excuse me. Just wrecking my wrecking my world here. Um that but 
oh dear, this is coming up. The um, paper behind it's very bumpy. So it didn't stick very well the first time around, I don't think. Um, what I'm wondering, got a few, got these postcards. This little, like the bird turned the wrong way. Okay. But I wonder if one of these would be good in this piece. I like this one because it's got some color to it. Yeah, I think I'm going to put that there. That's good. Um, what else do I have that this might work back here? It does. And then I just need like a little tag or something there. Oh, that's cute. Okay, we need one more thing kind of back there. There's another postcard. And this little tag. That's fine. Oh, I don't have anything in the bottom though, do I? Got some little tags here. How about this Santa? Yep. Okay. I'm sort of going at it backwards, but do these fit in there? They do. That's kind of cute. Okay, I was just looking at the subject matter to see if it went with Victorian. And then this one. Santa. goes with that pretty well. Okay. Okay, I need something in there and I don't feel like any of these fit the bill with this. What do we think of this? Hmm, I don't mind that. We'd kind of need a tab on it, I think. Actually, we had more than I thought. We need something there. Yeah, we're, we're getting there. You know, I think I'm going to stop for today because um, we're kind of at a good stopping point. And next time we'll finish this one up and we'll start on number five, if you can believe it. So thanks so much for crafting with me today, everyone. I hope I didn't either go long on you or short you or whatever. <laughs> So have a grateful day, everybody. Uh, be kind always, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.